If the number of carbons in the ring is greater than or equal to the number of cyclocarbons in the longest chain, the compound is named as a cycloalkane. For example, if I have this cyclohexane and the substituent is the butyl. So here I have four carbons. However, the cyclohexane is made out of six carbons. Therefore, the cyclohexane would be the parent and the butyl would be the substituent. And the name would be butyl since it's one substituent I don't need to give it a number cyclo hexane now in case I have the following hydrocarbon so this is cyclobutane and the substituent or the chain is made out of six carbons so here I have six carbons and here I have four carbons only in this case this chain would be the parent and this would be the substituent and the name is going to be in this case 1 cyclo butyl hexane and the reason I said 1 because the way I number this chain is 1 2 3 4 5 and 6 I need to give the substituent the smallest number on the chain now as I mentioned previously if the number of carbons in the cycloalkane is equal to the number of carbons in the substituent so here I have four carbons and also the cycloalkane is made out of four carbons in this case the cycloalkane will be the parent and the chain would be the substituent and in this case the name would be a butyl no need for a number because it's the only substituent cyclo butane